Okay, y'all, we are going up this hill here. It's that steep one again. So, Woo! This hill is steep, y'all. guys so i figured i'd bring you guys along and do a little walking look how pretty love this there goes a the squirrel so i don't think this bench was up here before but let's see what this looks like up here look at this view y'all So pretty. This view here does not even need sound. Like all we need is the nature, y'all. So pretty out here. <clears throat> so I'm just gonna bring y'all along and let y'all just see the beauty out here. Just a fern. So the last time I didn't go up that way and I'm not going to today, only because it's getting dark and it is 6.38 and I need to get home. I went home and changed clothes and got into some shorts and a tank top.
at this moss. So I have this little sirloin steak here that I'm going to cut some of this up and I'm going to fry it and add some onions to it and I don't know what else. I do have broccoli and stuff, but I think I'm just going to like fry it and add onion to it and I don't know. I'll show y'all, but just bear okay, with me. Okay, so I'm just going to cut this up. I thought I was going to do half of it, but I have Katie and her boyfriend here, and I'll take some of this to work tomorrow. Might as well just cook it all, so that is what we're going to do. I've never got one of these and cooked it this way, but I mean, it's a sirloin steak, so I mean, it cooks up just as well. It's just bigger. And I seen where you can save money doing this. So I got all this for 11 bucks. So that is what we're gonna do here, guys. Some people don't like fat in their steak, but I do. So I'm leaving the fat on here. Um, hang on. I probably should have like sliced this in the middle to make it thinner, but it'll be okay. I'm literally just trying to hurry with this because I have to be up at like three in the morning. So yeah, I got to do what I can y'all, but I probably should have made these thinner pieces. But I'm not going to sit here and do all that. So. so I have all this. So I have some butter in here melting. And I'm going to add some onions to this. With the steak. Okay so I'm going to add some of this broccoli. To this other um, pot here. I might need to get the other thing. Because that's not a whole lot. Yeah hang on. So I have my steak here that I'm going to put in here. This is just something fast and easy for me. Guys, I work 10 hours a day and I just try to do the simplest things. Hold on. Okay, so it. this is what it looks like. And I did cut this up here, but it's not
so over here in this, I hadn't put anything in there but butter. And y'all know my cooking videos, I'm not perfect. I don't appear to be no cook because I ain't no cook. I just make do with what I have here. And that's that. But this little bit of meat here, I don't know what's going on with this. I did cut it, as you can see. It's just not cut all the way through. So I might need to do something about that. Okay, so since I didn't marinate this stuff like I should have because it's just like a last minute top meal thing, I'm going to add some of this Worcestershire sauce, however you pronounce that. I don't know. And then we're going to add not a lot of this, but a little bit of the Dells. Typically, you would marinate it and then like pour it out, but you know, I didn't do all that. So we're going to do a little shortcut with that bad boy. And then let this go. I also added some of the salt to the steak, the broccoli, and to this water here because they're wanting some of these macaroni and cheese. So we'll make okay, them that. So I have this. Guys, I'm all over the place with this video, but it's okay. So I have that on high. I need to turn that down some, and I'll do that in just a second. But I have these Kraft mac and cheese. I'll be cooking these for about 11 minutes, and then I'll put all the other stuff in there. So we have the little cheese powder packet. Now this ain't all we're gonna put in here. We're gonna put this, we're gonna put some butter and more cheese, okay? So let me get that. Okay y'all, so I have the butter in here. I'm gonna add this to it. I probably need to turn the heat back on. And then I've also gotta add some milk to this. And yes, I know I need new pots and pans and I'll be getting some soon. Okay, we're gonna add some of this good old handy dandy whole milk from Dollar Tree. This stuff's amazing. slices of the sharp cheddar cheese Kroger brand I don't want to do Velveeta but I have Velveeta but I'm gonna add this because I'm gonna use this up and let that melt and everything is complete so that that and that and I'm gonna I'm not gonna eat any of this because I'm trying to stay away from carbs so I'm gonna add some cheese, like Parmesan cheese, and a slice of the sharp cheddar cheese, the my broccoli. I'm gonna eat that and that and call it a knot. So this here ain't nothing fancy, but I just kind of rigged this up because there's nobody here but me and Katie and her boyfriend and I was hungry and I didn't want to go get fast food, so here we are, you know. And they said that they were hungry too, so I made us all of this. Happy Monday, I hope everybody's doing good and is blessed and well. And know that whatever storm you're faced with, it's gonna pass, the sun's gonna shine, and tomorrow's gonna be a new day. So keep the faith, stay strong. And don't let the bad days win. Love you guys.